On January 12, 2010, a 7.0 magnitude earthquake struck Haiti, a nation of 9 million people and the poorest country in the Western Hemisphere. The destruction was staggering. Over 300,000 dead, over 1.2 million left homeless, and the destruction of much of Haiti's already limited infrastructure. The day after the earthquake, a group of Boston area health professionals formed Physicians for Haiti with the purpose of maintaining a sustained engagement in Haiti's rebuilding process. One year later, Physicians for Haiti and its Boston and Haiti-based partner organizations are working to support the education and leadership development of the next generation of Haitian physicians. The foundation of our philosophy at Physicians for Haiti from the beginning has been that the rebuilding of Haiti is not going to happen overnight, uh, that it's going to be a long-term process that is going to require sustained engagement in our part. I think what's so special uh, about the work that we do at Physicians for Haiti is that for all of us, all of us that have an interest in Haiti for whatever reason, either we've been there in the past, we have family there, we have friends there, um, for all of us, um, the work that we do together as a team in Physicians for Haiti is that it gives us hope. It's a group that is working to further an aspect of global health that people sometimes underappreciate. Uh, you know, not only trying to offer or facilitate direct service, but really trying to help the health practitioners of Haiti themselves both develop as doctors or nurses in terms of education, and then also helping them to gain resources that they can use to better provide health services to Haitians themselves. On January 12th, as you know, um, Haiti was st struck by an earthquake, and there are m many reasons that that was a great tragedy, but one of them has a lot to do about medical education, and that is that the nursing school w was completely destroyed, and the other um, professional training apparatus was damaged or destroyed as well. And for the first time in perhaps a uh, hundred years, um, there would have been no uh, medical school class graduating if not for the Fleming class. We are 67 uh, physicians who study medicine in Cuba. Now we are distributed in the 10 department of the country and now we are working with the physician for Haiti. Physicians for Haiti. Nous sommes très heureux pour ce travail qui, qui, qui nous fait avec nous. La dernière fois lors de la conférence, il nous a beaucoup montré beaucoup de choses. C'était très très bien passé. Tous les étudiants étaient très très très, très contents. Ce, ce, ce serait magnifique de continuer jusqu'à la mort de travailler avec Physicians for Haiti. It's a partnership with Physicians for Haiti. I think we have a project who be extend for a very long time. I'm very grateful that Physicians for Haiti exist really to support this terrific group of young physicians who deserve our support, who, who need pragmatic assistance and, and are curious and want uh, you know, to learn more and have access to information and, and teach each other and learn from us and teach us as well. It's a, just a terrific idea that um, a group of physicians uh, here um, uh, it would be so committed to a group of young physicians there. Physician for Haiti is a very committed group that supports Haiti and especially St. Boniface Haiti Foundation. They are very dynamic, dedicated, and uh, when they come, they don't just impose solutions, they come, discuss, and you know, they do exactly what exactly what is uh, best. From the first meeting I attended of Physicians for Haiti, I realized how dedicated they were to advocating for Haiti in a way that is just, humble, and well-informed. Um, through their strong philosophy of partnership, they've built really great connections both in Haiti and in Boston. We do partner with Physicians of Haiti to bring education, to just bring the health. And why we need the support of everyone without them, 
we cannot be able to do the work. So I'm just asking everybody to support us. Haiti is a very, very difficult place to live, to work, to practice medicine. And we all know that all too well. Um, but as an organization together, we've seen through the work that we've done thus far in this very short year that there is hope for Haiti and that if we continue to work together with the partners that we've made in Haiti so far and work together as a family at Physicians for Haiti, um, there are no limits. Donc, en signe de remerciement, <rire> la classe Plémy envoie ce certificat à Physician for Haiti pour vous dire merci beaucoup, merci, un grand merci, on vous aime tous, merci encore.